Well, hello, my friends. I hope you are doing well, and I am excited that you are with me today, and we are reading through the Bible together. Uh, right now, we're reading through Proverbs, and we're in chapter 9, and it tells us in chapter 9 of Proverbs, it says, Rebuke the wise, and they will love you. Instruct the wise, and they will be wiser still. It goes on and says, Teach the righteous, and they will add to their learning. Um, you know, a part of wisdom herself is, uh, is to pass on to those who are willing to receive her, to receive wisdom. We, uh, as God's people, are called to receive his wisdom, his counsel, his word in our lives. And so um, uh, it's a gift. Uh, the wisdom of God in our lives is a gift. And so what we want to do is we want to, uh, we want to be per people who are willing to be instructed uh, by uh, good godly wisdom, and we need to be willing to be instructors. And, and that can be as simple as just passing on uh, nuggets of truth, help for one another, encouragement, a timely rebuke in a safe place, in a good and loving way is a wonderful gift. It's a wonderful gift to give, and it's a wonderful gift to receive. Now, we have to have a good attitude, and we have to be, have humility when we receive it as well. So, we're to pass on the truths. Tim, uh, the Apostle Paul writes to Timothy, and he says, What you have received from me, uh, be careful to instruct others who will pass it on to even more. And so we, we want to keep doing that. That, that is what uh, we're a body of people, of, of God's people. And, and so we are to do this with and for one another. With love is the filter and, uh, and godliness is our guide. So, so never forget that. It is for the benefit, it's for building up the church, it uh, tells us in Ephesians 4. So um, if you're following the Lord Jesus Christ, uh, as it says in uh, Proverbs 9, verse 10, it says that the knowledge of the Holy One is understanding. And so more and more as we follow Jesus, we should be people who know wise understanding of life and of the kingdom of God. So let's just ask God today to help us to be a giver and a receiver of his wisdom. Thanks. God bless you guys.